Okay, let's get back to the competition that's starting on Monday. Previous video I made in 4K, so I couldn't edit it in. Now I'm making this one before the time, before tomorrow's beach walk, so that I've got it. The competition starting, a ski boat competition starting on Monday is the Junior National Competition. If you're not invited by your club to represent them, you wouldn't know anything about the competition. That's why there's a little information about it. Junior National Satsa Deep Sea Angling Competition. I think there's game fish or something in there somewhere, but anyway. See you guys Monday morning, 11 o'clock at Ocean Grill to watch the launches on the big screen at Ocean Grill. Okay guys, this is where I'll be on Monday 11 o'clock loading the videos on Ocean Girls big screen. Yes, right above the Wimpy of Dolphin Street, Ocean Girl. And um, I'm gonna have a pizza here. I believe they do a chicken liver pizza. I have to try that. So Monday morning 11 o'clock I'm loading the, the angling competition launches uh, videos here onto their big screen. If you guys want to see the loved ones launch um, you can come and have a look here. Great shout out to Ecofrost Solar Solutions for sponsoring uh, these extreme boating videos for the month of June and July. Thank you guys, visit them in the description below and find the links and contact details. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, it's Beatrice Vivius and Frankie Two Socks with your extreme boating video on this lovely, lovely Friday morning. Look at the beautiful sunrise here at St. Lucia History Mount. The boat launching site. The Rose Bowl is acting up, but not enough to scare the people people fishing is fishing somebody's got to do it if you've got a problem with your pronouns mm, you probably shouldn't be on the launch site but most of the guys they have got their pronouns sorted the T's crossed and the I's dotted Stella offloaded a little bit shallow, but Johannes got it under control. He just uses the rollers of the boat. Oh no, was it Wiseman? Just uses the rollers of the boat to push it in. No, that was Johan. This is Zahn and somebody else on the boat. But not floating yet. That's why it's easier guys just to pay Wiseman 250 Rand to push you the hell into the water. 
Okay, Stella got off the mud. Now going to pick up Johan right in front of the hippos. It's going to be an interesting pickup. I will want to see that. It's not getting through. Not getting through the channel, guys. The channel is closed up. Nope, it's not. He's going through. The channel that hasn't closed up. Sorry. on power coming down the channel it's very very shallow in the front Still are going to turn around, yes! It's opened up to the right of him, but he's turning back. He wants to realign himself. Rose Bowl is acting up on this low tide. At least on Monday when the angling competition is on. There will be more water on the sandbank. Much more water. And Stella is making a run for it. He just needs to get over that one foamy. And he's into the open ocean. Well done, experienced skipper. Fast boat, well designed hull. And let's go is floating. I almost missed, I missed the push, not almost missed the push. The Skibo Club tractor and Let's Go tractor is about the same tractor and I was watching the wrong tractor to move for the push. What a beautiful machine this Canon SX7. The HS is on the new monopod. Thank you guys. Very expensive gift. But it's a stable platform to shoot nice videos on. Still have a problem in pivoting around the monopod, but I will get around that problem. It's a very very stable platform. So the video quality increased with every angel and let's go on the power and he's running towards Rose Bowl I think this is Andre's first launch through the open HP mouth what's he gonna do with Rose Bowl he's waiting it out it's on the speed coming a little bit too much north where the people run onto the sandbanks when they force by that wave to come more north. But he's gone through it quite nicely. Well done Andre, just one more on your shoulder and you are out in the open ocean. Happy hunting, enjoy the day. Robert E. Lee being pushed by Wiseman. Big boat floating in the channel. Diana showed his skills here with the equipment that's functioning very well. He's not nervous by the time he gets onto the beach. All the motor starts and trims and the trim works perfectly. He doesn't have to worry if he gets here if the motors is gonna run or not. Robert 
TV coming down the channel. I'm thinking about Papa Zonke that's been turned into a whale watching boat. And he's lying still there in the front of the sandbank. Now he's moving. Sandbank is right there on his shoulder. Guys, look at the sandbank I'm talking about. Now you've got the reference towards the boat. The tide is already pushing, but you can see in the reference according on the boat, the sandbank is back. The one that I talked about before the spring tide is back. And Robert Dilly has got the two 175s roaring behind him, running for Rose Bowl. Rose Bowl is closing up in front of the on again as it normally does. He's trying to get in front of that one. He is going to get in front of it a little bit too far north. But he's got a nice gap just to the same place where Andre has got it. And that's a nice launch, Dion. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please subscribe. Press on me and pardet. It's free of charge. It just means YouTube will recognize you as an individual on the channel.